Morning everyone, it's uh, Friday. Um, now, uh, for years I've had a, a YouTube channel and uh, I've mainly put up pictures, uh, videos of what I did in the Lake District and camping in the Lake District and climbing in the Lake District, all sorts of nonsense like that with backing music. Now I thought I'd put a couple up uh, and put audio over them just to explain a bit about them. The Lake District is the most beautiful place in the world um, everybody should go. People who come to England just think there's London's England, it's not. Get out, go to the Cotswolds, go to the Yorkshire Dales, the Lake District, um, the Pennines, Scotland, everywhere. It's all very, very fabulous. Um, so, um, yeah, so this is me making it up the Langdale Pipes almost. Now, it started off with a really bad snow it ended up a really bad snowstorm the camera doesn't pick most of it up it wouldn't upload uh, to the to, to, to my computer um but it was a complete whiteout it, it really was it doesn't look bad on here but it turned into white and drove me off the top i've done it a few times i know how stupid it is to carry on when it's a whiteout so let's just watch it it's quite nice really <laughs> My baldy head. About five or six years ago, I think this. Beautiful. That's the outfall from Stickle Town. <laughs> yeah, I love it. Looking back across the Langdales to Swirl How uh, Coniston Old Man area. And you can see a diagonal line uh, going up. That's Pavey Arc. It doesn't look that impressive from here, but when you get on top, you realise how big it is. And we are standing in... You can actually see from the top, you can see the outfall as the stream runs out of Stickle Town. And we are actually standing... Well, I'm actually standing in the middle of it now. And you can see there's a diagonal path. You can just about make it out. And that's called Jack's Rake. Uh, it's not a particularly difficult or hazardous path um but it, it, it it's very 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 exposed and quite a few people have actually been killed doing it it's uh, it's not for the paint hearted i'm not doing it today because i've done it before and i've nothing to prove and that's my excuse <laughs> Beautiful, beautiful. I 
I think it was very early in the morning this, probably about six o'clock I think. Best time to be out on the fells. A human? Yeah, we actually saw um, a bloke with a camera tripod. Uh, on the top of the hill, uh, we saw him about two or three times. The only, I think, was, well, apart from a couple of lads, the only people we saw there. Must be getting colder, I've got my Montaigne hat on. I was doing quite well here actually because I've, I've been suffering from heart failure for about 10 years at this point, so I found it quite hard to get up. But I pushed on and I pushed on and I pushed on. It's really only the cancer that load me right up. See that's looking down from the top of Pavey Arc. You can see the Stickle Town and the outfall um, we were standing actually in the middle of that so you get an impression of how high stickle town is and jack's rake path comes out at a point just over the top of where my head is now uh, one year a lad came up there stood on the top uh reached up to do something with his rucksack and the wind caused him and blew him back down and that was the end of him i'm afraid and i think it's next stop harrison stickle This is where it started snowing. Only very light at first. Now it doesn't look so bad here but it got really 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 thick uh, and for some reason it, it the camera didn't record it but you can see hang on right on the edge right on the edge like an idiot Halfway up that hill, well about 8 metres away from me, when it really got thick, there were two men, two blokes, uh, and it, it was so thick, I could just about make out their outlines, and they never acknowledged me, I don't think they saw me, even though I got red on, it was so thick at that point, that I made my way back over, <coughs> I wanted to go down to Pike of Stickle, 
which is further on um but it was i had a couple of falls and it was it, it was madness so i decided to come down there were some lads who followed me about a mile behind me i could see them and they carried on when i turned left and kept started heading down they carried on up to pike stickle and then i turned around and they were following me down so they'd realized that it was a thankless task <laughs> Pay the arc in the background, in the middle. Great Langdale Valley. Langdale National Trust camp, uh, tent campsite. Been on there a few times. Expensive but nice. Car park where we started. And the sun's come out. Whatever, there's always tomorrow. We can over to Cats to Cam and Swirl Ho and
Yeah, I was just breaking in. There was, I think it was the first time I'd used them. I just bought a pair of Solomon Quest boots. And they were really good. If you want a decent pair of boots, get some Solomon Quest. They're not cheap, but they're alright. lasted me about, I think it lasted about two years, which is pretty damn good, the way I was clogging at them. Well, there you go. Um, yeah, so if you get over here, if you're from round here, get up to the Lake District. If you're coming over for a holiday, get up to the Lake District. It's the most beautiful. Get some miles into your legs on the fells. They're the most beautiful place you've ever been to. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. And uh, peace and love. Subscribe, press buttons, whatever. See you soon.